what's up everybody? Stoked. Up close and personal today. Today, uh, I'm going to teach you how to fish a wick. Um, it's getting, uh, you know, it's, it's time. It's, it's time to change the old wick out, so, uh, this is definitely a helpful, uh, helpful, uh, tool to know, especially when you're making coils, okay? Cool. First thing we're going to do, actually, you know what I need to do? Our oh, rings are pretty tight on this right now. Um, pop the hood off. You know, as you can see, just definitely, uh, had its last toot. Um, so cool. First step to fishing a wick. This is super easy, guys. Okay. Um, we're going to pull the wicks out. The old wicks. Okay. So, trick here is to be very careful when you're pulling it out to not disturb the wick or the coils okay you don't want to be pushing these or pulling on these at all in any way all right so let's go ahead and take this as you can see if you watch that coil it's not the best angle okay cool just like that okay uh, we're going to repeat on this side paying attention beautiful Next step, rinse it off. Oh, sorry about that. I just went ahead and I ran it under some uh, some water real quick, okay? Get it dry around the edges. You know, I'm just keeping it on the side. Okay, make sure we don't have any excess around here. Blow out the bottom, you know, just make sure it's dry to the best you can without disturbing the coils. That's key. Okay, here's what we have. See them? Let's see if I can get it. There we go. Okay, got both your coils just sitting there nice and round. No big deal. Okay, cool, man. Next up, these are these got a lot of uh, a lot of insulation on them from juice. Uh, they're black, as you can see. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and uh, fire it up. Now it's important when you fire this up to uh, pulse it. Okay, let's check it out. And what you want to see. Um, is they glow at the same time. All right, so we're gonna pulse it to clean it. Okay, pay see now watch them as they get. They should glow at the same time. Okay, see that? You just want to kind of pulse like this until that smoke stops, and that means that uh, you're getting uh, pretty clean. Okay, cool, just like that. No, uh, hopefully you can kind of see the gray. They're not so black anymore. If you look at if you were here, looking at it right now, now they're clean, brand new, man. Beautiful, man. All right, simple, simple. Next up, here it is, man. Had a fish a wick. Okay, uh, take whatever wire you got. Uh, the thinner, the better. In this case, this is. Just piece of 32. Okay, can't all. You know, you're gonna go ahead and make a loop like this. Okay, get your loop. Now, wicking materials. There's so many out there. Three millimeter, boiled, 100% cotton. All right? You're gonna take the cotton right into the loop. Boom. Okay. 
I like to even it up right here. Okay. Just like that. Now you want to take it, see that loop? And you want to crunch that down. Like that. Okay. Straighten it out. That's what you have. Simple, right? Now, run it through one of your loops. We're going fishing, baby. Okay, put them in there. Pull it snug up there. Okay, then get this close. And same thing, you don't want to disturb the coils. Nice and easy. Don't hurry it. Done. Okay. Just like that. Cool. We'll do it again. Okay. Loop. Cotton. Right in. Okay. See it? Now, what we do is we drop the cotton. <laughs> okay, we go ahead and match it up again. Okay. And you see that loop right there. We're going to take that and we're going to squeeze it. Okay. Get as straight as possible. Squeeze it really tight down. Pull it nice and tight. There you go. Same thing on the other side. Feed it through. Okay. There it is. Right on through, man. Just like that, man. Now I'm fishing. Pop that out. Now. You want to trim up these edges here. Uh, I take it to, I mean, you can do all sorts of fun stuff here, man. You can wrap it around, you can do an X, you can, there's so many different ways. Uh, have fun with it, man. You know, uh, that's what, that's the beauty of RDAs. I think, you know, it's, it's fun. Do your own thing, man. Have fun with it. Um, for the sake of uh, length of video, I'm going to go ahead and just trim these off real quick. scissors or whatnot. I'm sure it'll be faster. There it is, man. Brand new. That easy, that quick. You don't need to tear apart coils every time you want to bait them. When it gets old, just replace the cotton. Now we'll go ahead and uh, get it nice and wet, especially with cotton. You do not want to dry burn this. Uh, that's why it's good to test uh, when you pull the old ones out to make sure they're glowing nice, they're nice and clean. Uh, you can get back to it, man. So I'm just concentrating on the coil part right now. Okay, and then we'll just go ahead and juice it up, man. No big deal. A lot of fun. Um, there's a lot of cool uh, people out there on YouTube, man. Um, there and check them out. Uh, MC Vapes, amazing, amazing at this. Uh, I eat beaners. <laughs> I know, dude's awesome. Um, gosh, there's so many out there. Uh, Bishop Heels, incredible, incredible coil builder. And uh, yeah, man, have fun with it, you know. That's ultimately what matters. Cool. Let's we'll see how we did, man. Yeah, I think we're all right. And also, I'm looking for both sides to be spitting out vapor. Let's we'll see. Yeah, we're good, man. So now we line up the air holes on the side with the coils. 
like that. Let's see how we did, man. I think we did good, man. I definitely encourage you to try this at home. Um, real simple technique. But, uh, super effective. Um, yeah, man, happy fishing. And, uh, that's how you fish a wick. Any questions, comments, whatever, uh, post it down below, man. Take care, guys. Oh, wait, we gotta end it the real way.